Thank you. Do I have so many educational awards because I am comfortable? And I am not seeing myself. So I'm going to go this way. Do I have so many educational words because I'm comfortable speaking? Well, because I speak so often. I know the answer because I remember. I remember my heart palpitations, the feeling of heat filling my body, my throat tightening, and my stomach knotting. So why do so many speeches? <laughs> Two main reasons. First, to reach my own personal objectives, my goals. Since I joined Toastmasters, I've grown. I was a wannabe. I wanted to be able to speak and to tell stories. I wanted to heal myself. Now, my thoughts and my voice need to reach more. There's things to say. I am not fungible, and that is one of also truth, just like Lisa. But there's a second reason, and that's to support Toastmaster clubs, because none of our clubs are fungible either. Why am I talking about Toastmasters? supporting Toastmaster clubs. You support Pikes Peak wonderfully. Pikes Peak is distinguished, but that's not true for all of our local clubs. When I was division director, we had 22 clubs local. Now we've got 16. What happened to those clubs? This year, we have eight distinguished clubs. That means we have eight that are not. Four of them are fairly healthy, and four of them have eight or less members. Imagine being a member of a club with eight or less members. How many times are you going to speak? How many double or triple ropes are you going to have? Are you going to get tired of hearing the same people and decide that Toastmasters isn't for you? Our local clubs are important. And yes, I remember several clubs. Three distinguished. Three or not. And I speak at more than those. Why? They need a fresh face. So that's why they let me do it. Sometimes they ask me, sometimes I contact them. I am telling you that you can do the same thing. You can reach out and help someone. You can make a difference. And it can help you as well. It can help you share, get in different voice, uh, different situations. Sometimes just changing the environment makes a difference. So those are the main reasons. And my main focus today is talking you into visiting some of those clubs. <laughs> now, and in the meantime, going back to pathways, there's several ways you can work on it. One, is it actually costs less to buy all the pathway paths. And then you have your total choice of any project in any order. And it is fun. It's, <laughs> it is definitely fun. And I need you to check that out because <laughs> you need to check it out. <laughs> now, sometimes I contact them but what about why I gave five of basically the same speech? Now, if you give the same speech in the same club, they're going to get awfully tired of you, by the way, even if you improve. 
come visit other clubs and do it. But why do I do it for myself? Why do I make the choice? Because I know that that project has something for me. It gives me a chance. Now in contest, we always do it. In contest, you will practice that same speech. And that is what makes you a world champion is practicing the same speech or similar speeches in different ways, making that connection to your audience. So I'm going to continue on to, since this is basically hopefully a persuasive speech, I'm going to continue on to the action because persuasive speeches require a action statement to end them. My closing statement, our local clubs are important. Some of them need your support. One of them has already been suspended. They've got seven members. For, unfortunately, that one is in Pueblo, but they do do Zoom. Um, all the others are in Colorado Springs. But help the clubs. It will make you feel better. It will give you a chance to improve. No club is fungible. Mr. Toastmaster. Thank you, Bonnie Ann.